General John J. Pershing is dead at 77. He made history in Mexico in 1916, commanding the troops in pursuit of Pancho Villa. Seasoned by 30 years of campaigning and executive posts, Pershing was sent to join Marshal Foch in the World War. Then peace, as Woodrow Wilson offered Europe his 14 points. 32 years of soldiering lay behind the great chief who had commanded the AEF. He knew triumph as America's man of the hour. 14 nations heaped honors upon him. Decorations for achievement in war and in peace as a soldier and as a statesman. In 1937 on Flanders fields, Pershing made a final plea for Europe to keep the peace he had fought to make lasting. Hatred and suspicion still exist and armaments at enormous cost continue to grow. And if no cure is discovered for this temporary madness, we are in a hopeless state. For of one thing we may be certain, and that is, if another world war takes place, Western civilization as we know it cannot survive. He was the idol of the cadets at West Point, where he was graduated in 1886. Time cannot dim the greatness of his deeds. 